when I was first learning how to code, I would try to memorize everything that I could. The first couple months of me learning was probably spent me reading and watching videos and memorizing everything that I thought that I needed to memorize and really not writing any code and not building anything. And that was a huge mistake. And a lot of beginners make that mistake of trying to memorize stuff. And I've said this before in other videos, but the truth is you don't need to memorize anything. Just learn enough to be able to figure out what it is you need to Google and how to find the answer. You don't need to focus on memorizing everything. It'll come in time. Don't get hung up on it. Don't waste your time memorizing stuff because that's what it really turns out to be. While it does help you remember a few things, a lot of the stuff that you might be memorizing, you might not use for a long time and then you'll still end up having to Google it because you're not gonna remember it by memorizing it you know, right now and then three months from now when you actually need to use whatever you were memorizing, it's gone. You, you, you don't remember it at that point because you never used it enough to really truly know how to use it. So memorizing is good, but just memorize through muscle memory and repetition. Don't memorize through reading the same thing over and over or watching the same video over and over or watching the same tutorial over and over. Focus more on concepts and how stuff works. And to do that, you'll just need to build things. So what I recommend is just learn enough to be able to Google the answer of any given thing that you're trying to work with. If it's HTML and CSS, learn enough HTML and CSS to be able to Google what you're trying to do with HTML and CSS. Learn enough JavaScript to be able to Google and try to find what you're trying to do in JavaScript and then apply those things. And that's how you learn. There's a lot of time wasted with tutorials. There's a lot of time wasted with watching videos. There's a lot of time wasted with a lot of theory and people don't do any practice when they're first starting out. And you can get overwhelmed and not even write a single line of code and give up. Stuff just seems so alien and complex that I would get caught up really feeling like I needed to read as much as I could and watch as many tutorials as I could and watch as many videos as I could. And now that I've been doing this for a few years and I understand that really all I need to do is Google something, check out the documentation, and read through some of that and just start using it. And that's what I do with any new tool that I pick up. And really that's what you should be doing when you're first learning how to code. Just focus on understanding the basics of what you're trying to do and then just go from there, start building stuff. Don't be scared, take the training wheels off, fall, skin your knee a few times. It's okay, you'll get back up, you'll Google the next thing, you'll Google the next thing, you'll figure out your problems and, and that's how you'll grow as a developer and that's really all, all there is to it. I wasted a lot of time trying to memorize stuff that I, I didn't need to. And that's what I'm just trying to tell you out there now. If I would have had a little bit of guidance, if I would have had a mentor, if I would have had someone that would have shown me the way when I first started, I would have been a lot better off. But I didn't and hopefully by me just telling you out there that if you're in this a couple months and you see that you're still doing tutorials, you've been doing tutorials for too long and you need to start building your own stuff. Even if it's just a you know static website, even if it's just uh, an if else statement that you wrote on your own to figure out something. Even if it's small and it seems trivial, try to build stuff on your own. And trust me, by doing that, you'll get better so much faster. And that's what you should be doing if you're learning how to code. So don't memorize anything, just Google everything. And that's it, pretty much. All right, that's it, I'm done talking. Thanks for watching and make sure to give this video a like and I'll see you next time.